Frequent launches of Falcon 9 rockets with Starlink satellites were quite usual in recent months. However, SpaceX has been busy with launches of payloads from paying customers in the past few weeks, so there was no time left for their own Starlinks. 50 days have passed since the last launch of those satellites. On December 17th, at 21.32 UTC, nine Merlin rocket engines roared to life on Florida's 32A launch pad. Another Falcon 9 launched on a Starlink mission 437, and it was climbing sky-high on a column of fire and smoke. Falcon is fishing downrange. We witnessed several milestones and records during this mission. First of all, it was the 200th orbital flight of a launcher from the Falcon launcher's family. That means not only Falcon 9 rockets are included, but also Falcon 1 and Falcon Heavy rockets. In addition, with this launch, SpaceX was able to conduct the third Falcon 9 launch within 33 hours and 46 minutes. In order to be capable of carrying out such an immense launch frequency, the company had to utilize all three of their launch pads on both coasts of the USA. The most interesting record of this mission was probably that the first stage of the launcher was used for the 15th time. SpaceX has once again pushed the limits of reusability. Let's see when that first stage will lift off for its 16th time. Its landing on the Just Read the Instructions drone ship was indeed successful. Therefore, it can be prepared for its next mission. This time the Falcon 9 delivered 54 Starlink satellites into orbit, which will provide internet connection around the world. The total number of launched Starlink satellites exceeded 3,600 after this mission. Don't forget that Spaceflight News is also on Twitter. In addition to notifications about new episodes, you will also find other interesting news from the Spaceflight over there. Just click on the link in the description below.